How are you doing this evening, ma'am? How are you doing this evening, ma'am? It's a pleasure to meet you too. It's a ple pleasure. How are you doing this evening, ma'am? Ask where are you going? 137 South Reflection Road. On and on. Sorry to keep you waiting. Long day? Very. And what do you do for a living? I'm a politician. Sounds like you have an accent. Where are you from? I am from Syria. Do you like it here? Going, In the States, going, that is? Yes, ma'am, I do. I love America. Came here a few months ago as a refugee. In America, you're free to go anywhere you like. It's the land of the free. At least it used to be. You know, things are really changing here. I'm sorry for what happened in Paris. All those innocent people. One customer told me it's your fault that all of this is happening. Why don't you go back to where you come from? I said to her, I would if I could. You see, I'm Muslim, but I'm not a terrorist. Excuse me? I can't even remember the last time I prayed. With everything that is happening around the world, sometimes I think to myself, is, is God even real? Has the world turned to a bunch of godless people who pretend to believe in God. We got more country like this coming soon. I'm really sorry for what happened in the name of Islam. I was born Muslim and I know these are not the teachings of the Quran. I'm sorry for what happened to your people. The suffering. absolutely nothing to be sorry about. What can I say to make him understand none of this is his fault? You must know, ma'am. I'm good man. I will never hurt another human being. Well, I'm glad you're not a terrorist. That would have made this trip very awkward. Since we're being honest here, I might as well admit that I'm not a terrorist either. I'm white, but I'm not a supremacist. Did you know that the majority of fatal attacks on US soil are carried out by white supremacists? You didn't know that, did you? I want you to know that I am so sorry for all of those people that have been racially profiled. I'm sorry for the, the Charleston church 
shootings and the nine African Americans that died in those shootings. But I would never discriminate against people by burning down a mosque or or not letting them in the country. I am sorry for all of the attacks. And I am sorry for the U.S. involvement in the Middle East. And I apologize for the uninvited U.S. troops that are currently in your homeland. And I apologize for the drone attacks associated with the U.S. fight against terrorism and the many lives that have died from those attacks. I'm not Christian. I'm not even religious, but still, I apologize on behalf of those that have organized domestic terror in the name of Christianity. You have arrived at your destination. But you have to know, I am nothing like them. You are a weird lady. I get it. Never thought of it that way, but but I get it. Alright guys, uh, we have like five minutes before we're gonna start shooting. I translated the original post and I want you guys to hear the actual story. And the translation might not be perfect, so don't talk shit. She says, one night I took a cab home from a friend. Then driver and I start talking a little about everything. And after a while he asked me what I did for a living. Obviously some